Well, the IRS is pushing back at the beginning of tax season, and that's raising concerns for many Americans who depend on their tax returns. Normally, the filing period begins in late January, and that allows those early birds to submit their returns and, of course, get their refunds fast. But now people are going to have to wait even longer. WCNC Charlotte's Lexi Wilson joins us from Uptown with more on this. Lexi? Filing season will now start on February 12th, which is bad news for a lot of people who are really banking on those refunds. The new year usually means tax refunds, but you'll have to wait a little longer for that cash to hit your bank account. According to the IRS, they need more time to prepare after the COVID Relief Act that approved the second round of stimulus payments in December. The new start date to file your taxes is February 12th, two weeks later than normal. But many people are still waiting for those government checks that were promised. Rent's due, food on the table. I was really depending on it. So what do you do if you still haven't received your stimulus payment or it's less than expected? You can file it through your 2020 taxes. Here's how it works. On the 1040 tax form, go to line 30. You'll fill out the recovery rebate credit to get the money you're owed. You're entitled to it anyway, so you want to make sure you get it, even if it just simply reduces the tax you already owe. Still, for many who are barely getting by, having to wait, is gut-wrenching. I actually have $16 to make it till Friday when I get paid again. So yeah, I was really counting on that money. And yes, the deadline is still April 15th. Reporting in Uptown for WCNC Charlotte, I'm Lexi Wilson.